Hey Poppy, you can wake up now. Poppy, please, wait, wake up. I need to say sorry. Poppy, just please wake up. I'm so sorry if I know this would happen to you. I wouldn't have been so mean. I know this would I'm sorry! <laughs> Poppy, please. You... I, I guess I was just jealous. I don't know. Let me go grab a tissue. Poppy, why can't you just wake up? Where am I? What? <gasps> Poppy! You're... You're awake! Daisy, what are you doing here? Get out! I, I don't want to see your face. You hurt me too much. But first, tell me... I'm so confused. Daisy, what's going on? <sighs> Poppy, I'll tell you, just please forgive me for everything I've done at the beginning of the year. Just, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to be a jerk. I, I was just jealous or, I don't know, but I'm so, so sorry. No, no matter how confused I am, I will never, ever forgive you for what you did, Daisy. Get out. But Poppy, you, you don't understand. I... I said, get out. Poppy, can't you just listen to me? Daisy, I hate you more than I've ever hated a person. And I don't hate people. You're worse than Riley. You're worse than Emily. Oh, heck, you're worse than the person who bullied us in grade two. So get out. Otherwise, I am calling security, or whatever runs this hospital. Get. The. Hell. Out. You know what? Fine. I didn't even mean the apology anyway. Gosh. Oh, um. What's happening? I just saw Day. You're awake! Oh my gosh, Poppy! I'm so glad you're okay. We thought you'd never wake up. It's good to see you too, but what do you mean I didn't wake up? I'm so confused. Why am I in the hospital? Why did Daisy just try coming in apologizing to me? Why do I have an IV dug into my wrist? Lexus, what's going on? I'm so confused. The last thing I remember is driving to the dance and then everything is blank. We got in a car crash. What? On the way to the dance, a little kid ran on the road. You turned and we hit, I think, a tree? It's kind of blurry to me too. Anyway, they took me out and all I had was a sprained ankle and a few broken ribs, but everything was so hazy. All I remember is seeing you getting pulled out of another truck. You're completely bloody and you had a huge gash in your head. I... I... What else? I ran up to you crying and they told me that I needed to sit down since I had a concussion. I asked them again and again what happened and What's wrong with you? I was so confused. Probably as confused as you were right now. But all they did was just take me into the ambulance car with you, where they started treating me. I was so worried. Then finally, once you got to the hospital, your parents, Jason, me, all of our friends from our junior high, like everyone that you knew pretty much in your life was here. And that's when the doctor told us that you didn't have any serious injuries, but... But what? But you had a brain hemorrhage. 
and blood was rushing through your brain. You were currently in surgery, and they are, they said that you were in a coma, and they don't know when you're going to wake up. They said it could be years, months, it could even be tomorrow, but they guessed years. But I'm awake now. I know, and it's... It's like a miracle. I should get the nurses to check on you. Okay, but wait. Is Daisy still there? Could you wait maybe until she leaves? Hopefully she's already gone, but she came begging for my forgiveness. Just because I got in an accident doesn't mean I'm going to forgive her. Apparently when we were in the car crash at the Halloween dance, Riley and Emily poured a bunch of stuff all over Daisy. She became the laughing stock, and ever since then, she's been bullied. It's December, and she's already getting bullied in, like, freaking September. Wait, it's December? You mean, December 25th? Or, or... Don't worry, it's actually December 1st. You woke up on your favorite holiday. Now, I need to go get the nurse. Why don't you just stay in here and read all your thank you cards and stuff? Okay, bye. Alright, everything seems to be very well. I think you can actually go home tonight and possibly even make it to school tomorrow if you're not feeling hazy. Um, so why don't you call your parents or get a ride from a friend. But yeah, everything seems to be completely fine. I am so happy you're awake. It's absolutely a miracle. You know, I was the nurse that was taking care of you and changing your IVs. Oh, thank you so much. Okay, well... Uh, can you drive you home? <laughs> of course, what kind of friend would I be if I didn't drive my friend who just got out of a coma? Wait, scratch that, my best friend who just got out of a coma. <laughs> Come on, again, thank you. Yes, thank you. It's been a few days since I got out of the hospital. I decided it was a good idea to stay home a few days before going back to school since I just need to wrap my head around a few things. I haven't caught up on everything, but since I've gotten back, this is my first day and, well, a lot has happened. And no, not with schoolwork. A lot of the time, it's people asking me if I'm okay and how I am. Hey, oh my gosh, I just wanted to tell you that everyone is so glad you're okay. I never really got to know you, but all I know is that you were a really kind person. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. Now, I know what you're thinking. Wouldn't that be nice? Well, it's not really. I mean, like, I don't know half these people, and they never looked at me once. Well, that unless it was that little bit of the time when I was popular, but I don't know. I don't really like this attention because I don't know any of the people and it's just kind of weird but yeah it's my first day back and it's not too long after um I think lunch so yeah everything's kind of been normal so far I haven't ran into Lexus, Daisy, Riley or Emily thankfully or well Jason can I make it to my locker um I don't know I'll try Whoa, <laughs> you guys gather rather quickly. <laughs> so yeah, I guess you can say I've become the new it girl in school. <sighs> Why does she always end up being the one that everyone likes? Why does she get everything she wanted? Well, well, well. If it isn't Little Miss Freak. <laughs> freak? More like bitch. <laughs> Good one, Emily. <laughs> Leave me alone. Why? So you can continue being jealous of your- Oh, so old BFF Poppy? 
Yeah, actually, it's quite sad. <laughs> Leave me alone. Honey. You can't get away from us that easily. I mean, we only just started. Listen, I don't want any trouble. Just please leave me alone. Aww, but then we wouldn't be able to get to do this. <laughs> yeah, or this. Ooh, ooh, and don't forget about this. <laughs> yeah, yeah, thank you guys. Okay, well, um, I gotta get through. Thank you. Oh, finally. You might leave me alone. Huh? Oh. My. Dog. Stop it! Ugh, what the hell? Stop hurting her. Leave her alone. You're both so awful. Why can't you just see that she doesn't deserve this? Maybe she was a little mean, but, but she was your guys' friend. Uh, huh? What? See, that's what she does. She'll let other people take the fall for her and let other people get hurt. You know, we were willing to give you a free pass today and possibly for the next month just because of what you've been through. But now that you've defended her, the person who only visited you in the hospital once and that was the day you happened to wake up, the person who talked behind your back the whole entire time you were there, telling everyone that you wanted to hit the kid but Lexus didn't, so she stopped the card. <sighs> But, since you defended her, we will go at you even harsher than we ever went at her. Yeah, I mean, she doesn't even put up a fight. This wasn't supposed to happen like this. Aw, what? Were you supposed to come and defend her, and then, oh, uh, take over the bullies, and then become the nice girl, and the two being best friends again, along with Lexus, everything being perfect, you guys graduating without any trouble? Hun, no. Besides, you're kind of taking away our popularity. Scratch that, you are taking away our popularity, and we can't allow it any longer. So, it's, I guess it's a good thing that you made us realize you're well enough for us to ruin your life, or continue ruining your life. Don't you dare. I am on my last. Hey, babe. Hmm? <laughs> oh, Poppy. Poppy. I'd like you to meet my new boyfriend, Jason. Your boyfriend? <laughs> 